Hey everyone, Glenn Walker, Midwest Tournament Angler here. You know, it's about the second weekend in March. Things are starting to melt up here in the Midwest, and so now I'm down in my in my fishing area, getting my tackle ready for this upcoming tournament season. Plano's came out with a lot of great products over the years, and there's some new products this year I'm really excited about. I think it's going to really help me out on the water, save time, and keep my tackle organized. Uh, one of the first products that I'm looking forward to using this year is the Plano 4700 two-tier stowaway. What's nice about this is the dual level. So I'm using this this year for like my flipping jigs and chunks. On the top here, I have all my plastic jig trailers. And down underneath, I have the jigs. And what's nice about that is that is that since this box is always in the boat with me, since it's always in the boat with me, I can easily, quickly grab a jig throw on a trailer and be ready to fish. And that way too, I can easily tell when I'm running low on a certain size or color of jig or a trailer and I can make sure I stock up for that next trip. Since, you know, flipping a jig is a staple lure for most bass anglers. You know, combining the jig and trailer into one case is a great way to save time from monkeying around in your tackle locker, grabbing two cases. You can grab one box, rig up a jig, put that chunk on there and go catch your next fish. I also do the same thing with my swim jigs and grubs for those. Uh, what I did with this one is I left some room up on the top for whatever swim, color swim jig and grub I'm going to be using that certain day. I can throw a few of those grubs up here so I can quickly change a, grab a new grub for my swim jig after, a, after I catch a fish. Plano redesigned their waterproof cases this year. And what's really great about these cases is their new, the new cam locks on these. They really lock in there. I mean, when you hear that lock, it's locked. So I'm, this is the uh, 3640 waterproof case. And I'm using this case to keep all my troll car hooks organized and dry. With the hook, the price of hooks uh, on the rise today and, you know, being high performance hooks, you want to make sure those hooks stay sharp, dry, so there's no rust. Keeping them in a waterproof case will ensure that. I also use these waterproof cases to keep my uh, the new laser sharp tungsten weights dry. Keep them all nice and organized. I don't have to throw a lot in the boat. I can just throw in there what I'm going to need for that day or during that tournament and have those ready to go. Keep them nice and organized. Don't have to worry about them coming out of their where I have them, the spot in there because the cover is so close to them. Keep them nice and organized. They have the bigger stowaways in the waterproof as well. This is the 3740. Again, um, any you know any baits that you're going to have in the boat on tournament day, you know you're fishing in all kinds of conditions. You know in the spring it could be raining, sleeting. You know you don't want any of your baits to get wet. So this is my jerk bait box. You know spring is a prime jerk bait season. You know you have real expensive jerk baits and you know, that you have in here, you want to keep those ready to go, organized. I always like no to have some extra cigar fluorocarbon around. This way, you know, the new Tatsu, I can keep a few extra spools of that in my boat, neatly organized in the line box. That way, when I, if I need a quick make an on the water change, change to different pound test, I can quickly grab that spool out, spool up, and be ready. This to spring, fish. as you get your tackle ready for your 2011 fishing season, look to Plano for all your tackle needs and really put some time and thought into organizing your tackle now because the time you spend now on that will save you time on the water when you can be catching fish and not messing with your tackle. Thanks a lot, and we'll see you on the water.